now we have the demo for you okay just give me a second <laughs> hold on let me open up my environment uh where is it here it is all right yep uh we can have a look at the demo all right so first up i am kind of showcasing the tableau core the tableau desktop uh for the kind of you know showcasing what type of reports what type of uh, visualizations we have so this is a data set that i am utilizing it's for a retail industry which is selling both offline and online so here we have a table uh, which is kind of heat map of table which is telling us like in the central region of us uh, from office supplies the binder and the binder accessories are getting the most sales and office supplies are something which is getting the most sales for us so it gives us that clarity so it helps us easily understand which of the sub category from these product category is doing how well in these specific regions so it can do that then we have the total sales division over here then we have the capability of you know seeing the sales and then uh, viewing it on a map as well so if you can remove we from the slide i will show you yeah so over here we have different different states of us like the 50 states of us and if i uh, kind of you know search it like that it will simply show me how many sales uh, is happening in that particular region so uh, this data set is configured for the state region uh, so that's why we are seeing only state if it would have been configured for city or some zip code we would be able to see that as well next up we have this kind of dashboard so this dashboard is showcasing us this capability like the total sales in every sub category so office machines is doing the most sales then we have chairs then we have telephones it is delivering us that kind of information then we have this kind of information from uh, this uh, the shipment perspective the shipment perspective is telling us in the january month there were these many sales out of those regular air sales were regular say uh, regular air uh, carrier shipments were these many Uh, express air were these many and delivery truck were these many now what this information is going to help from a business perspective just look at it and try to understand if you are seeing the trend then you can identify like with which particular carrier provider that i am uh, utilizing i need to have a better deal with or maybe i need to add on some more carriers into my business so that i can reduce the cost of it so you can rely on to that kind of data then we have this kind of view again it's a different view of uh, uh, delivering the same information but it is definitely helping us like tables in the east is uh, 36000 uh, sales and in the central region they have also made 36000 sales so we can rely on to that then we have more uh, kind of views this is the bulleted chart that we uh, kind of uh, view uh, earlier like when she was kind of calling out the name so this kind of chart helps us identify like how the furniture sales is in this month and how it was in the previous month so this red line is showcasing the previous month sales and this complete bar is showing the this month sales so try to understand from the business perspective how well and how easier it would be to see how we are doing for this month as compared to the previous month it will definitely help us do that and uh, we can definitely utilize the these part of things so that was a tableau core part of things now i have quickly jumped into the crm analytics uh, so in crm analytics again i have created some uh, demo data i could not show you our customers data because we would not be able, that would not be the right and thing to do so we have kind of created some data that we are showcasing you so this is account analytics so it is giving us giving us account profile so again this is for retail industry itself only so we can see the cases breakdown like how many cases were escalated how many cases were not escalated the case priority low medium high the case origin from where they originated email phone so this kind of view helps uh, a business owner somebody managing the retail segment identify like where they need to put in more efforts into whether it's the email side of things or whether it's the uh, chat kind of things like where they where the most customers are coming in from the how the experience is they need to kind of look into that so they can definitely rely on to these kind of information this chart is showcasing uh, the number of cases that they have created and how many time it how much time it takes to kind of close that so if i click on it it is kind of you know doing uh, the drill down into it just by clicking on to it so we have this and then we have opportunity analytics so this kind of uh, dashboard from uh, crm analytics is showcasing how well the 
pipeline is performing so we can see like there are uh, these many in the qualifying stage these many need analysis stage uh, and then we have the sales executives information over here so we can simply understand like uh, john has 6.2 million sales coming in from his existing account but he hasn't gotten new businesses he has only uh, uh 1 million 700 uh, yeah 1 million 723000 sales coming in from that so we can see that if i click on to it it will give me a drill down of that as well so it helps us understand that like how our uh, sales executive are doing and which in particular section they are doing that the and we have the component uh, then we have the case analytics it is showing us how many cases are closed how many are in working stage to whom they are assigned into we can view that as well then we have product uh, component uh, kind of dashboard which is showcasing what type of products we are selling the most so accessories we are selling 22 laptop 21 digital phone 19 so this is kind of helping us identify that and then this is the white space which is telling us uh, which particular account is uh, buying which type of things from us so like this uh, account anderson is buying cables from us and the total sum of sales is 3444 dollars 40 dollars so this is the high level dashboard that we can get there are multiple more dashboard that we can create the tableau pulse part we could not configure into this environment because it would require a separate environment and we don't have access to that like you don't have an access to that and i could not show case my uh, customer production environment so i don't have that particular thing but this is how it looks uh, i have opened the tableau site itself only so you can see the following uh, like you can see the reports that they have they are following appliance sales branch revenue campaign roi so tableau pulse this gives this kind of information like uh, appliance sales is seeing an up unusual spike while branch revenue and campaign roi are steadily increasing so it is telling us that if there is uptick we need to see why there is an uptick so that we can make the most out of it we are not running into hiccups like the inventory is not there or the proper education is not there for the sales executive so this helps us do that then uh, uh, as i said earlier uh, crm analytics have its own kind of things internally data prep recipes so uh, data flows is basically how you can you know see the way the data is flowing in from where it is flowing in then we have connections where we can get the data from different different sources whether it's salesforce Heroku, Redshift, uh, MySQL, Azure. There are multiple connectors, and you can definitely have uh, more connectors from App Exchange. Then uh, we can use recipes to do all of that. So yeah, we have those capabilities with us that we can utilize. I will not be going deep into the lens, uh, the app part, the dashboard part. They are something uh, which we can cover maybe in the next webinar or maybe in some different videos. So I will not be going deep into that. So this is how uh, the Tableau works. This is how Tableau can be beneficial for your business, and how you can embed it into your uh, business itself only. And one thing, or uh, just to add on top of it, having CRM analytics gives you the right insights at the right time when you're opening up an opportunity. You can see all the information about it. When you're opening up an account, you can see all the information about it. You can link Tableau Pulse. insights into that account itself only so you have that much clarity as well so you can leverage those things yeah. so that was the demo piece of it the next topic is why tableau and in order to make you understand why tableau i would not go into any explanation we really want you to download the pdf that we are going to share in this webinar so go check out that uh, yes we'll just skip this part If you really want to know why Tableau, we have already covered some things here and there. Uh, but please just go ahead and download the uh, presentation that we have created, and you'll get detailed information onto everything that is being delivered onto this webinar.